We know that a lot of commodity markets are great breakout markets. It makes sense to buy higher highs and sell lower lows. And you can click a link right here to see which commodity markets are the best breakout markets. But what about mean reverting markets? Commodity markets where it makes sense to sell higher highs and buy lower lows. Now there aren't many mean reverting markets in the commodity world, but today we're gonna run 60,500 tests and find out which commodity markets are mean reverting. So mean reverting commodity markets, let's Let's get into it. Hi everyone, it's Dave Whitcomb from Peak Trading Research in Geneva, Switzerland. My goal is to make you a more profitable trader with commodity market insights and real systematic trading strategies. And today we're going to be building and testing a mean reversion strategy. We're gonna start with the same code from our breakout strategy video and instead of buying higher highs and selling short lower lows, we are going to be selling short higher highs and buying lower lows. So what this simple strategy does is it's looking for markets that revert to the mean. It's looking for markets that trade in a sideways channel. Now using our AlgoLab tool at peakalgo.com, we can test our length input from a value of 1 to 50. So if we were looking at daily bars, we'd be testing from 10 days to 50 days. We can use a stop loss from $1,000 to $5,000 per contract, and we can test our bar value from 10 to 50 days. That's 125 parameter combinations tested across 44 different futures markets and 11 different bar sizes. And that's a total of 60,500 different tests that we're going to be running on this simple mean reversion strategy. So after running 60,500 different tests on our simple mean reversion strategy, we can see that Nat Gas is a pretty good mean reverting market. Arabic Coffee is okay, but there is one market that stands above them all as the king of mean reversion, and that is the cocoa market. If we look at a price chart of the cocoa market, we can see that it exhibits some mean reverting behavior. It trades in a sideways pattern where it generally makes sense to buy lower lows and sell higher highs. And if we look at how this trading system has performed, look at that. That is a nice upward sloping equity curve, which means our simple mean reversion system has made money over time in the cocoa market. So the bad news is that our simple mean reversion trading system doesn't work in a whole lot of commodity markets. But the good news is, is that our algo lab tool allows us to show that the cocoa market is really the world's only strongly mean reverting market another way to say this is if you're a professional cocoa trader you should really consider always selling higher highs and buying lower lows that is simply what will make you the most money so let me know in the comments below if you would trade this very simple mean reverting strategy in the cocoa market and as always hit the like and subscribe button for more great stuff from peak trading research good luck trading cocoa and we'll see you soon Thank you